All right, let's talk about something super cool. Try foldable phones. Imagine having a phone that folds not once, but twice, giving you all sorts of screen versatility. It's like something straight out of a sci-fi movie. It all kicked off with TCL. They were the first to show off a concept of a tri-foldable phone way back in 2019. Fast forward to 2024, and they've turned that concept into an even smaller concept, from 10 inch to 7.85 inch when it's all unfolded and reduced the thickness as well. That's pretty cool. But let's be honest, it's not blowing anyone's mind considering other foldables are already in that ballpark. But TCL isn't just about the fold. They've packed in some neat features too. They've introduced this thing called Sensor Under Panel, SUP Design. What's that? Well, it means you can unlock your phone, make payments, or even do 3D facial recognition, all with sensors hidden under the display. And with a pixel density of 420 ppi across the whole screen, everything looks sharp and seamless. Plus, they've used LTPO technology, which lets the screen's refresh rate jump between 1 and 120 hertz, depending on what you're doing. That's a fancy way of saying you get smoother visuals and better battery life. But TCL isn't the only player in the game. Techno, a brand you might know if you're from Africa or India, is making some serious waves with their Phantom Ultimate 2. This one's a beast, measuring just 11 mm thick when folded, which is thinner than the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and rest of the tri-foldable phones. That's impressive, right? They've even managed to keep the bulk down by using the industry's thinnest battery cover, just 0.25 mm thick, thanks to some super compressed Titan Advanced Fiber material. That's nearly half the thickness of what's standard in the industry. Their tri-foldable phone opens up to a massive 10-inch internal screen, with a 6.48 inch cover screen for good measure. And get this, they've integrated the display driver and touch sensor into a single chip, so the screen is not only bigger, but also more responsive and efficient. Oppo is also jumping into the mix with their own tri-fold concept. This one's all about sleek design, with a triple display setup and super thin bezels. It's still early days, so we don't have a ton of details, but from what we've seen, it's likely to have a screen that stretches over 10 inches when fully extended. Plus, it's running a modified version of Color OS, complete with big widgets and a taskbar, making it perfect for multitasking. And then there's Xiaomi. They're not one to miss out on the fun. According to some leaks, they're working on a tri-foldable phone that could hit the market by 2025. While the details are scarce, it's rumored to come with HyperOS 2.0, a Leica-engineered camera setup, and a top-tier Snapdragon chipset. Sounds like Xiaomi is aiming to bring some serious firepower to the foldable scene. Finally, let's talk about Huawei. Word on the street is that they're planning to debut their new tri-foldable phone, the Mate XT, in September over in China. But as for when or if it'll be available elsewhere, that's still up in the air. Huawei's got a big event lined up on September 10th at 2.30 p.m. It's where they're expected to officially show off the Mate XT, along with some other cool stuff. There's already an image floating around of Huawei's CEO, Yu Richard, holding what looks like the Mate XT, giving us a sneak peek at how it looks when folded. Despite being pretty complex in design, this phone is rumored to have great thickness control, about 5mm when unfolded and 15mm when folded, so it's going to be sleek and easy to handle. The Mate XT is also said to have a centrally placed hole punch camera on the far left of the internal screen, and it'll be powered by Huawei's own Kirin chipset. According to a tipster on Weibo, this tri-foldable will use a China-made UTG display, which should add to its durability. Design-wise, it sticks with that classic circular look that Mate phones are known for. The back even has a camera setup similar to the Mate 50, with a decorative rim around it. So, that's the scoop on Huawei's upcoming tri-foldable. It's clear these companies are making big strides in the foldable market. If you're into keeping up with the latest on this, stay tuned. Catch you in the next one.